So, so the thought, my thought and the emotion behind my thought really can come out. You may be showing more than you think. <laughs> We're back to that again. We are. We? <laughs> yeah. Because no, number one. I, I mean, we're back to 101 because if indeed I look at you and my very first thought is, oh no, that's, that's an agenda right there. The, oh no, is an agenda. And I have to really go, huh? Wow. That wasn't what I was expecting. <laughs> wow. <laughs> ah, whoa. Look at you. Oh my heavens. You you have on colors and whoa yeah let's see but that idea that i'm leaning way back and giving myself a lot of support as i'm trying uh, wow i tried that i've heard you say that before and i walked into the playroom the other day and the kids had just crashed it it was just everywhere and i very intentionally paused and i thought i can either say this is a huge mess start cleaning it up now or have y'all been having some fun in here <laughs> it looks like somebody's been having a lot of fun completely different feel but it also made even though I wanted to say, this is such a mess. By saying those other words and making sure that my face looked surprised, yeah. but okay, surprised, ended up making me feel a little bit better and okay about the situation. So <laughs> now, who can bring me the favorite thing that they did? Let me see your favorite thing you did. Look around. What was your favorite? All right, let's put it on the shelf. Cool. What else? Because you're going to spend a lot of time cleaning it up one way or the other. And you can spend a whole lot of time going, pick it up. I don't want to pick it up. I'm still playing with it. Just saying. You're so right. Yeah, I've been there lots of times. Sometimes... I can hang with it. And sometimes it's like, pick the beads up right now. <laughs> Don't make me say it again. <laughs> oh, you do sound like a mother. <laughs> that down. Oh, that was perfect. Don't make me say it again. It's like, huh, wonder if I could do that. I bet I could. Mm -hmm. I, you must, you don't, Christopher is not the one that makes me think that. That's Miss Emma. Mm -hmm. Oh, she's so literal and she wants to test me. Will she say it again? Oh, there she is. She said I it bet again. I can make her say it again. I yeah. bet I can. I bet I can. And that's more Bra Braden is really, I mean, he loves to pull people's chains. I mean, it is his favorite thing to do because look at all the power and control. And it's like, Braden, I see you've dumped that again. Mm -hmm. All right, let's clean it up. <laughs> Tell you what, I'm gonna put that up. Yeah. Yeah. Emotional. It's no. <laughs> amazing to me how somebody so young and Braden's younger than Emma. Yep. They can put those pieces together. They can read body language. They read ex facial expressions and emotion. And yep. Yep. And yet, Amazing. how you know how skillful we can be at, ooh, I'm gonna pick up all the pink ones. And then of course, that's Braden's cue for blue, blue. <laughs> it's like, you're gonna get the blue ones? Okay, you find the blue ones, I'll find the pink ones. It's like, oh, man, I'm gonna put the lid on before he gets the last one in. I say, okay, tell you what, okay, I'm gonna open the lid, put the last one in. There we go, all right. But that means my brain has to be working both on task and relationship. Yes. And it's this juggling act. And yes, it takes fuel. Because in that moment, you're bringing with you, how am I feeling? What is my brain state at that moment? Yeah. 
I thought I was going to walk in here and everything would have been mostly cleaned up and all I had to do is pick up a couple things. <laughs> it's not what I saw. <laughs> I mean, you don't play with one thing and then put it up before you play with something else like I do. I mean, yeah, not at, not at my house. No, I don't think no. so. I've got unfinished business everywhere. <laughs> so, so once again, we're realizing that reflections and expression is for everybody. Yeah. I mean, we like to think wow. it's somebody else's problem, but in fact, you know, how much stuff do I still have out that I could have put away? Now, when I'm at my peak, yeah, I do it, I put it up. I do it, I put it up. But then something gets in the way and it's not if I spend time, it's how I spend time. And it's like, I went on to something else. Uh, well, that probably doesn't belong on the back side of my desk. Oh, I'm betting this actually doesn't belong back there either. Yeah, it usually goes somewhere. And it's like, I wonder what, oh yeah, yeah, I remember there was this webinar and I was, yeah, oh yeah, I remember now. Well, thank you so much. Once again, very, well, very helpful. Thank you. I am really glad that we have sort of gotten to a place where we can get to the agenda, um, where we can decide, not now, but we recognize the importance always of the relationship and the connections. And the only way to do it is to really be willing to learn from what works and what doesn't and practice. And if something doesn't work, am I ready to make a change? Yeah. Yeah. Or what maybe, wonder, wonder what the components were that didn't come together there. Was mm -hmm. it my expression? Was it my reflection? Was it the connection? Was it time of day? I mean, oh man, so many possibilities, which is kind of exciting and kind of overwhelming. Yes. But the only way you get better is to get started. That's right. Start somewhere. Sure enough. Thank you. Thank you. Hey folks, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to help us spread Teach's Positive Approach message around the world. And don't forget to click the bell to get notified when new videos are posted.